right, we got a new one for you. The guy's name is Marcus King. <laughs> and he is an American musician, singer, songwriter, and guitarist. Best known as the front mad lean singer and guitarist for the Marcus King Band. He had a 2019 album called El Dorado, and it received a nomination for Best American Album at the 63rd Annual Grammy Awards. Nice. Anyways, uh, my niece uh, recommended I listen to this guy, and that's freaking awesome. I appreciate you, and um, we're going to go ahead and check him out, so see you guys in a minute. Here we go. Marcus King. Marcus King is with us in the studio. His new album, uh, is that the debut solo album, Marcus, that we're talking about? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. El Dorado, that comes out in January 2020. He's in. Speak theater, December 21st, all the four <laughs> dates, MarcusKingBand.com. He brought, and I want to say Dobro, but it is not a Dobro guitar. It is a national guitar. Yeah. Uh, that is a gorgeous guitar. And uh, you want to play a song for us? And if so, tell us about it, and then just go for it. Yeah, I'd love to play a song for you. Uh, on this record, I had the pleasure of writing with a lot of uh, greats, and uh, Dan and I sat down. Dan Auerbach. Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, we sat down with a, a handful of different writers. He said on uh, he said on the record he he, he play, got to play with a lot of greats. So I'm definitely when I get off of here, I'm definitely gonna gonna look into that to see see exactly you know who those greats are, and then there's you know there's more people more artists that I get to find out about or we can find out about I should say the riders in the area that and if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe hit that like button the bell share the video man if you don't like the video let us know why down in the comment section and uh, don't forget to send us your suggestions thank you Madeline it best suited what I was trying to go for on this record and this is one of those songs that came out when I was writing with Paul Oak Street. Uh, incredible writer, big fan. Tell us about Paul. Um, Paul is just one of those legends. He's almost like a myth. He's done so much. Is he a Nashville cat? Yeah, he's a Nashville guy. Um, and uh, just a pleasure to work with. And just a beautiful human being, an even better writer somehow. And uh, this is a song we wrote called uh, Beautiful Stranger. Man, real quick, there it is again. I love, I love the sound of a guitar. I absolutely love it. I always have. And I want to know, like, how many of y'all, how many of y'all, when you hear somebody play the guitar, especially good, you know, like this guy, I'm sure is. Like, how many of you wish that you could do this? You know and then how many of you have attempted it or do play it you know don't don't be shy let us know down in the comment section if you got a guitar let us know beautiful stranger Expected the, that voice to come out of the guy, like wow, uh, man, I gotta back that up a little bit. Let's do it. Beautiful stranger. Different. 
I've never heard. I can't. There's nobody that I can relate this guy to. I can't think. It doesn't sound like anybody that I can think of. At all. And in and, and, and looking through some of his songs, I saw that he played with Chris Stapleton at least once, at least at some show along the way. I don't know how many times, but at, at least once. So I'm gonna have to check that out too. You got a secret. like this it's so abnormal but yet it sounds so good and I get lost in just in just listening I'm not really I'm having a hard time focusing in on exactly what he's saying so that I can study it and then repeat something back to you guys you know or, or let you know what I think I'm, I'm just lost in the music I'm like in a trance almost <laughs> but I definitely need the lyrics but uh, but I like I like the sound of this dude, man. I, I really do. It's different, and I like different. Beautiful stranger, so lovely tonight. Could that? Hey, no phone calls. Could be my future. about him but really what I should have done is about the song so do noted I will do that next time because um, now I really want to know exactly what it is he's talking about what he wrote I'm assuming he writes most of his music um, but if anybody happens to know about this guy or this song go ahead and go ahead and let us know in the comment section let us know what you know please
sounds like like an old timer with like a whiskey voice or something. A whiskey with the de <laughs> He just doesn't match up. He, he didn't he don't look like what you think he would look like or something, you know, if you just listen to him. Another guy that was like that for me was Josh Turner. Oh, man, when I first heard Josh Turner back in whatever that was, 99 or something when the Long Black Train came out. I heard that dude on the radio and then and then I seen his CD in the store and I was like, great God almighty, whoop. this dude, that's him? This guy right here? <laughs> I know that somebody that's in my, that one of my subs knows what I'm talking about. I know, I know somebody does. If you do, go ahead and leave a comment. And, uh, Anyways, thanks for watching. Let us know what you think, man, about this guy, Marcus King. And um, just if you feel like leaving a comment, leave a comment. Other than that, I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.